सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक विद अनदर वीडियो ऑन के जी आई एस प्लग इन डेवलपमेंट सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट अवर फर्स्ट प्लग इन सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट इट सो वॉट वी नीड हेयर दैट एज आई एम फॉलोइंग दिस डॉक्यूमेंटेशन टू क्रिएट माई प्लग इन सो दिस डॉक्यूमेंटेशन सेट दैट यू नीड अ क्यूटी डिजाइनर क्यूटी क्रिएटर सो इफ यू गो टू योर विंडोज एंड टाइप क्यूटी then you can see that qgis is already giving us the qt designer so it's a good thing that we don't have to download and install qt uh, from another uh, another website so qgis is already giving us this so the software this software is look like this okay so the Q, what is qt designer qt designer uh, help you to build your ui your plugin ui like uh, adding buttons check boxes you can see right over here you can build your own layouts push button tools tool button radio button and etc okay so let's just cross it and minimize it okay so we have a qt then what we have to do so the procedure what is the procedure so as uh, i told you in my previous video that you have to download uh, plugin builder for uh, uh, plugin building plugin so we have to download plugin builder and uh, we already downloaded plugin builder so uh, let me show you and qgis go to your qgis and as you can see this this is the plugin builder so open it so uh, now what we have to do that uh, fill this form okay so what will be the class name the class name will be according to your plugin name okay so i'm just uh, giving this class name code with z okay plug in the same as code with z okay so uh, in description you can write anything about your plugin like what does it do and etc so i can write it this plugin is an automation GIS automation plugin. Okay. Then come to the bottom module name. You can type uh, the same name as the module name. Module name and company name. You can type anything. Work with them. Email. You can provide your email. okay so after giving all this uh, information you have to click to next button and this say that if you want to add uh, something some more description in your plugin then you can uh, write uh, about your plugin what your plugin do and etc okay what is the purpose of developing this plugin? so right now i'm going to leave this at a, as it is because we are learning so leave it at as, as it is okay show code with z okay and the template says that tool button with dialog yes it's a tool button with dialog and uh, menu menu means said where do you want to place your plugin so if uh, you want to open your plugin so where you have to go so right now it says that uh, you have to come to the menu and go to the plugins then you can find your plugin or if you can add your plugin into database then it will show you in inside the database widgets if you want to show this uh, plugin in raster sets then it will show up right over here 
so right now leave it as a menu okay then now click on next and click on next so bug tracker public mandatory item so what is going to be fill in it let's see what we have to fill in this so it says we do not instead of publish the plugin you may have the bug tracker so uh, the uh, so the publication and publication publication means if you want to publicly uh, make this plugin as a public like uh, all public can download and use this so you can provide a link over here okay repository mean where is the code where uh, is your old plugin is and all that okay so right now i'm going to leave this as it is and click on next select output directory your plugin is ready to be generated select the output directory mean where you want to save your plugin okay so let me just make a output directory okay so tube plugin builder and in this i want to save it so i want to save it with the name of uh, so i have to select a folder so i select this qgis plugin select this folder okay now click on generate okay so as you can see that your plugin is successfully generated and click on ok button and as you can see this code is this plugin is generated uh, ok so how we can run this plugin so now our plugin is uh, ready so what you have to do that uh, copy your plugin where you created your plugin ok and uh, paste it into this directory so if you go to in your c drive users then go to your name username then app data roaming qgis qgis3 profile default python plugin and paste your plugin right over here simple so, okay so now what you have to do that uh, close your qgis and open it again So now your QGIS is open and if you go to in your plugins and uh, go to manage and install plugins. So as you can see that your plugin is right over here code with then okay. So your plugin is successfully created and if you click this you can see that this dialog is open. So this dialog is now empty because we haven't do anything in it and in uh, my next video I will teach you how you can design your own UI in your plugin okay. So see you guys in the next video and if you like this uh, video then uh, hit the like button and share it with your friend and colleagues and subscribe the channel. Thank you.